Hey, what's up guys? It's Holden Nose here. In this video, I'll be showing you guys how to enchant your spells and make them better. There's a lot of items in Deep Book that can make your spells very, very powerful, and I'll be showing you guys how to rename your spells. So let's get right into the video, guys. So, starting off with the things you can enchant your spells with. Every spell is different with you, you can enchant it with. Um, all the ingredients to enchant your spells are going to look something like this. They're going to be purple, and they're going to look like these. So, they're all different, they all do different things. They all look like these kind of weird looking items. Most of them look like sparks, like this. Uh, and then some of them look like this, or like that. Or like, my favorite one is this one. So. I'm going to give you guys an example of how the spell system worked right now. What you want to do is you want to go to a place where you can use a spell crafting table. The only one place that I know of right now that has them is the Temple of Virgil. So what you're going to want to do is walk in, go up these stairs, up these stairs through here, go this way, this way and right over here. So in here, there is a uh, little pad, this is a crafting station. And how it works is you take your whatever mantra you wanna use and put it in here. So you might be wondering, how do you put your mantra into this form? So what you're gonna wanna do is you're gonna wanna make a fire, a campfire, or for fire users, you guys can just use graceful flame. Summon a fire and use this. So go to your mantras. Take whatever mantra you want to upgrade. So, for example, I'll be showing you guys. I'm going to be upgrading uh, the flame exertion. Uh, I renamed it Felinor Eliminator as a joke. So, I'm going to take this out. So, click Recall Mantra right here. And I'm going to say yes, I would like to recall. And then I'm going to click Leave. And now the mantra is in my inventory as a mantra slot item. So, what I'm going to do is you're going to put it right here. And then I'm gonna put what I wanna use it with. So I wanna use Cloudstones. Cloudstones make the spell bigger. So let me show you guys how, how big the spell is right now. So let me just take it back really quickly. So right now, the spell is, it's right here, it's this big. It's pretty small, but it's around this size. And let me recall it. You have to recall them every time, by the way. Just letting you guys know. So wait, hold on. I'm gonna walk away from the fire. Oh, I think I, I think I just glitched my screen. That's pretty funny. But yeah. Uh, so you go, so you go here, and you take out your flame repulsion, and I'm gonna put it right here, and I'm gonna put the three cloud stones in. Right there. Uh, you're going to say whatever you want it to be named. So Felinor Eliminator, just like this. And then you're going to click E. This will give you your uh, mantra back with the new name that you picked. And with the cloud stones, it will make it way bigger. So let me give you guys an example here. So you saw how big it was from before. Now it's way bigger. It goes across the whole entire room now, rather than just this one little area in here. So that's how you guys upgrade your mantras. All these different sparks, uh, driftwood, aeon, longstones, all that kind of stuff is different with what they do to each spell. So you guys can go ahead and test and figure out what they do. Remember, each time you unequip the mantra, it resets all its stats. So it'll reset the name and all its stats. So you only want to unequip your mantra if you want to actually change it. Thank you guys so much for watching the video. Make sure to like and subscribe. Have a wonderful day, everyone, and goodbye.